What a week it has been. There's been a lot of developments in the government assistance for us, for rideshare drivers, for gig workers. So in this video, we're going to talk about uh, EIDL, PPP, and the uh, unemployment benefits that um, you know where most of us are still waiting for. So we got readers uh, comments we're going to go over. I got some emails. I got some graphics that some readers have sent in. And at the end of the video, I'm going to jump onto my computer and go into my unemployment uh, benefits account and show you the latest update here in California. Everybody, it is Jay Crater with the Rideshare Guy. Early on a Friday morning. Have you ever wondered where all those articles and videos come from? It's right here. <laughs> There's my laptop. That's where it all gets edited and written and all of that. And then you'll see right over there, that's my inspiration, travel. Uh, my calendars, both my calendars have uh, beautiful beaches. That's where I want to go. And someone asked me what that is over there. I used to live in uh, a beautiful little house in Sebastopol and it had a deck that looked over a forest and it had an outdoor bathtub with hot water. So it was beautiful when it was foggy. You just get in there and have some bubbles, really nice. A friend of mine took a picture, colorized it, and I've had it ever since. So that's what that is in the background. All right, let's jump in. We're going to go onto the computer and we're going to start off with the EIDL program. All right, all right, let's start this. Uh, we're going to start with the EIDL because that's the one that's uh, there's the least to say about it. So here I am on the EIDL page. Economic Injury Disaster Loan Emergency Advance and Notice Lapse in Appropriations. So there's, you can't apply. Um, so this one's just like dead. Oh, so. Paycheck Protection Program, a little bit different. Here I am on the PPP page of the SBA.gov website. And PPP resumed April 27th. That was on Wednesday. So I got to think there are like millions of applications that uh, got submitted there. So for us, uh, a lot of us were just independent contractors. This program is available to us, and uh, if you have a you know a business banking relationship, um, you know you can apply through your bank. Um, what I've recommended is that you find a fintech company. Um, fintech company I've recommended. Um, and I'm not, we're not getting paid by Lendio, is uh, Lendio. And if you go to Lendio.com, you see round two of PPP is here, but not for long. Submit your application now. This was the latest correspondence that I had received, and this was yesterday, 17 hours ago, uh, April 30th. Update on Paycheck Protection Program. And they're basically, this is from Ready Capital. So Lendio takes your application, um, checks it out, and then they forward it to a... Uh, I think it's called an underwriter, and then the underwriter will uh, take it from there. So I sent this in almost two weeks ago, and um, they say the funds are reserved for me. This just says that they're working as fast as they can. They've hired some new people, things like that. So um, it's just a wait and see. So should you apply? I say go for it. If you got about a spare hour, go to Lendio, get your stuff submitted. They seem to do a good job. And they've they've man they've gotten lots of extra people so that they can handle the volume. Okay. All right. Before we jump into uh, the unemployment benefits section, I wanted to invite you to click on that little up up little finger up up like it like the video. That'll help other people to uh, to see it. Subscribe if you haven't. To, uh, if you're a driver, a gig worker, uh, we bring out four or five videos every single week. Keep you up to date. And also turn on notifications. You know, we do uh, uh, pretty frequently, we do a YouTube live. And you'll be notified when those are, and those are just a blast. All right? All right. Now, people are getting some money. Here I've got a, uh, uh, one of our readers named Adam. Um, so after the PUA uh, made, made funds available to us in California um, on the 28th, uh, he already had his, his card. And as you can see, he got some money deposited into his account, right? So that's pretty good, you know, deposit like that. So there, there is money, and I'm gonna show you my account in just a second, okay? Um, but what I first wanted to do was go through some readers' uh, comments and questions, okay? 
So this was from the video that I did last week, um, which covered all three. So these questions and comments re re refer to all three. Um, so here's the, Louisiana really seems to have their, their stuff together. Um, yes, I've gotten unemployment here in Louisiana. Louisiana. Uh, little known fact, my dad was born and raised in Crowley, Louisiana. That's, uh, that's how I get my Cajun name, Crater Credu. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, didn't apply for PPP, as it seems that you can't get both. Could be wrong. Yeah, I don't know. That's a good point. Um, but you're getting unemployment, so that's great. Um, I, I still say apply for everything, and uh, if if you get both, then then you got a problem uh, to to deal with. But I don't know that you necessarily have a problem because all of this is so brand new. Um, Shannon says, "Wonder if should reapply." Are we still in line? This is about the EIDL. Well, you can't you can't reapply because they're they're not taking new new applications. Okay. Uh, let's see this next one. GSA Architecture. Um, thanks for the useful and uplifting information. He's a driver. He sent in his paper application. Still waiting for a response. Enjoy your coffee. Yeah. My little double Nespresso shot. Um, Jay, one question I've gone on many of this. This is a question that comes up a lot because um, we recommended that you apply and we know that once you apply, you're going to get uh, told you have zero benefits. And um, should you, so there's a question um, when you apply the second time uh, that says, uh, "Did you have you applied recently? And the answer is absolutely yes. They know that people have applied already and were told zero benefits. So um, yes. But just put yes, be honest, because they know anyway, right? What are you going to say no if you've already applied? Then, then just say yes. Um, I did, and I'll show you uh, where, where I am in my process so far. All right, here are some more comments from the same article. Full-time Uber driver applied for both and have application numbers for both. All right, so he applied for PPP, and he's waiting, um, and he got, he got funds allocated. So he's in the same boat as me. Should I reapply for both? I use Lendio, too. No. No, well, you can't apply for EIDL, and you're in line. You're at the, you're at the the front of the line. If you reapplied again, that'll put you way back. And I don't know what, how they would handle getting two applications, um, uh, Lindio. So no, just uh, hold. You're in a holding position like me. How many weeks do we get? Six hundred dollars extra. Sixteen weeks. Basically, it's the month of April, May, June, and July. Um, Sixteen weeks at six hundred. That's nine thousand six hundred dollars. Okay. And then the last uh, reader comment I want to talk about here is, yes, I got my EIDL -E 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 deposit this Monday. He applied on March 30th, and then out of nowhere, he found an extra $1,000 in his account on April 20th. Um, this is the same thing that happened to our own Harry the Rideshare Guy Campbell. He applied and uh, earlier this week. Um, he applied several weeks ago, and earlier this week, he had just $1,000 drop into his account. We heard that from several of our readers. Let's jump into uh, my, uh, okay, so here we are. This is what the California uh, Unemployment Benefit website looks like. Um, this is where you start. They don't just like have one button that you get in. It's crazy. So here you click on uh, UI online. Then you got to scroll here, benefits programs online. Then you go down again. You got to log in and register. Then you go down here and you log in. Okay. Look, I am not a robot. Log in. Okay. And then you got to put in you log like that. Okay. And then you get to this page and you go to UI online. And uh, you just go, oh, okay. So this is this happens sometimes. Hmm. So it won't let me in. Interesting, isn't it? Um, it wants me to log in again. All right, let's see if we can get it the second time. I'm not a robot. Log in. Log in. Okay, good. This time I got in. Okay, so now we go to register or manage. And this is uh, this is pretty cool. Pretty cool. Look at that. It says my claim balance is $6,513. So Harry and I were trying to figure out, well, what exactly is that amount? And um, I thought it was all the money I would have earned through 
week after next. But if you take this amount and you divide it by 167, which is the weekly amount for the, 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 the basic uh, before the bonus, um, it comes out to 39. So I believe this is 39 weeks uh, times 167. So on the one hand, I'm like, well, great, there's some money. On the other hand, I'm wondering, well, what's going on? Where's the $600 that's supposed to be on top of this? So um, I'm again, I'm in a holding pattern. Um, I need to get the debit card, and then um, at that point, I'll see exactly what I'm entitled to. But so. All right, so what are the key takeaways here? That's a lot of stuff to go over. We covered a lot of, a lot of ground. A lot, a lot of happened this last week. But still, it feels like things are moving still pretty slow. Um, even though I see that amount in my account, I don't know when I'm going to get it. Um, they still have to send me a card and then... You know, what exactly does that amount mean? But the philosophy remains the same. Apply for everything. And if you get something great, and uh, let us know. You know, we'd love to hear uh, success stories. We really love to hear success stories. And uh, the other key takeaway continues to be get to work on your plan B. Take this downtime to kick ass. You know, turn yourself into whatever it is you want to become. Do you want to get in better shape? Do you want to uh, improve a skill, you know, improve a skill set? Do you want to start a business? Do you want to become a freelancer? There's so many things that are available now, and many of us have the time um, to pursue it. So that's my, my biggest key takeaway. As I said in the middle of the video, like the video, please, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed yet, we'd love to have you as part of the team. We're bringing out like four to five videos a week, and we will always bring you the latest uh, up-to-date information that we have as we're all trying to get that money that we so richly deserve. You'll go out and have a great day and be safe out there.